Hey, what's going on, guys? It's your boy JC, and uh, welcome to another Legion guide for 7.2.5. In this guide, we're going to be talking about how to level up the Underlight Angler as quick as you possibly can. This is not a guide about making money with it. If you want to see that, let me know because I can make decent money with this with this fishing pole. It's actually pretty scary on how well fishing does. But uh, this guide is all about leveling the Underlight Angler. So as you guys know, it takes artifact power to level this pole. And it it's incredibly slow once you start getting up there. Uh, it's only like 50 experience or 50 artifact power per rare fish. So what this guide is going to hopefully do for you is teach you the fastest way to catch these fish and to gain experience that I have found through not a whole bunch of testing but me and my buddy split up he fished his area I fished mine and on average I gain about 6,000 to 7,000 more experience per hour or more artifact power however you want to say it and uh, with this guide you can easily get between 17,000 and up to like 30,000 artifact power per hour depending on RNG um, I got not really that lucky while making this video but that's beside the point so what we're gonna do is we're gonna go into black barracuda fishing uh, as soon as you get your your fishing pole and you start catching some fish make sure you put points in black barracuda fishing so what you're gonna want to do is get those arcane lures if you don't know how to get the arcane lures I'll put a little video on the screen right now showing you how to get those but you're gonna get the arcane lures because those increases your chance to catch bait by a hundred percent you should know where to get them because you had to use that to actually unlock the fishing pole. So once you get those, get a few of them, go to the auction house and just buy yourself a decayed whale blubber. You don't have to, but it just helps start the fishing process. You're going to put the blubber on the ground, you get the fly to come to you, you grab the fly, and that right there is going to give you the bait to catch the, uh, the legendary barracudas or the monster barracudas, whatever they are. But that's not the bread and butter of this guide or of this method the bread and butter of this method is catching the sharks so when you're ocean fishing you have a chance to catch the stunned whale shark which will drop anywhere between seven to nine of the sea bottom squids so that is incredibly incredibly OP I get a bunch of them you'll see in this video that there is at one point where I caught two sharks out of the same pool which is just freaking insane now I want to mention to you and I want to point these guys out you can't have more than one lure in your bag at a time you just will not catch one so I went ahead and I bought myself a decayed whale blubber I catch a decayed whale blubber very soon into my little 10 minutes of fishing so that right there you don't have to worry about lures that's why I said just buy one lure but you catch these whale sharks and it is freaking insane how much experience that you can gain over an hour on these whale sharks it's all based on RNG I know it sucks but the whale sharks are freaking insane so if you're wondering why I'm doing barracudas one it's the sharks but two if you look at the area the density of these fishing poles or these fishing pools are insane there are so many pools in this little area that nobody fishes like nobody is fishing the barracudas which just makes it prime time this experience you know if you go and try and fish the kois people are fishing kois and fishing the kois is good for money guides by catching the sleeping murlocs but this is all about experience and there is nobody here there's no mobs around you to aggro so you don't have to sit there and, and deal with fighting anybody it's just it's just free, easy experience. You kick back, throw on some Spotify, and just fish, and you will level like it's nobody's business. It's incredibly insane. At the end of this video, or at the end of my little 10 minutes fishing segment, I'll show you how much fish I caught. I will show you um, how much barracuda I caught, because you could actually make some money from this guide as well, just selling the barracuda that you catch. Uh, on my server, the barracuda sell for 15 gold a piece, and I'm pretty sure... At this video I caught like 80 or 81 I'm not sure I was doing a live recording session but I had my mic muted I'm a moron but um this fishing is just insane so we're gonna power to that part we're gonna power to the end of this little 10 minute segment and I will show you guys exactly how much experience you can get 
while freaking fishing. These dang barracudas. So my arcane lure is about to fall off here, or it just fell off, and I'm about to lose my uh, my lure for the ancient black barracudas. And I catch a freaking barrel at the end, which is sweet. So we're done fishing. That's our 10-minute segment. So we're going to fly over here to the land real quick, and uh, we're going to see exactly what I caught. So if we look in our bags, I caught 35 ancient black barracudas and 23 of the sea bottom squids. So that is uh, 58 fish times that by 50 is 2,900 experience. If you times that by 6, that's 17,000 experience in 10 minutes. And that is just absolutely insane. Insane. And that's with, and that right there is with poor, crappy RNG. So this is definitely a super, super good way to catch fish. It's super handy. It's just freaking insane. So hopefully you guys enjoyed. If you did, click that thumbs up button. Be sure to subscribe. Leave me some feedback. Let me know how I did. I'd really, really appreciate that. And hopefully this will get you guys some, some quick, easy fishing levels. But uh, again, hopefully you all enjoyed, and I will catch you guys later. Peace.